Hey everyone, before I get on to it, remember to like and subscribe and comment down below and head over to my Patreon page to help support the channel. Well, today we're going to look at the milkweed pods. So, right here is a good patch right by a trail, right here, that there's some milkweed pods all growing right here. Monarch butterflies love milkweed pods. So, I've been seeing some monarch butterflies this year already. And you don't want to go too big of harvesting these pods. Like this one right here, if you can see the size of my hand, that's a little bit too big. You want ones that at the biggest, like this one over here, you can see, that one's a little bit smaller, about a, uh, a little bit less than an inch wide. That one's good. About like a half an inch wide is good for sticking in stalks and uh, stews of the whole thing, of cooking whole. Now, the ones that are like this big are more for just eating the interior. So Brandon's with me today, and we're going to try the interior of these two pods that are a little bit the younger ones right here, and show you how it tastes. Easy to harvest. You just pluck them right off. Now they have a latex on the interior, so if you can see, it's like a milky kind of sap coming right off. And then on the back of this, if you can see, there's like a line coming right down right here. That is where you want to split it open. Okay, so right here is where you split it open. Opens up nice and easy. And you pull out this little thing. If the seeds will tell you if they are a little bit more stiff, they're not as good to eat. So this is about the largest you want and you want it easy to break. And a little juicy kind of point and this is not as easy to break so this one is not a good one to just eat okay let's try has a vegetal taste kind of like a green bean so remember get outside get fresh air and have fun see you next time